Let me say there's no question, first of all, that we have an epidemic in Kentucky with drug addiction. Uh, it costs us about $5.9 billion annually. That's just in monetary costs. Now, in human suffering and breakup of the family, it, it, it's just unconscionable the costs that we have. So let me lodge you, uh, Pastor Jones, and, and other folks that are working on Hope to All. Uh, Faith-based initiatives in drug rehabilitation have been the most effective. Now, without faith-based, we find that the recovery rate is much less. It's not near as effective. Recidivism rate is much higher. If you look at that, 80% of foster children are there because of a drug-related problem. By rehabilitating and providing the services that you all are doing and working to, to establish here, uh, you'll keep families from breaking up. You'll restore people. As I said, I believe in redemption, not only eternally, but I believe in right here in time. And, um, you know, we're not going to incarcerate our way out of the drug problem. If you take someone who's addicted to drugs and just simply put them in jail, now if they're not violent, obviously, any violent offenders need to be there or someone that's a threat to the community. But someone who's not and just addicted to drugs, you put them in with hardened criminals without any effort. You haven't done that individual a service. And when they get back out, they have none of the tools. Uh, they have none of the help and assistance and support groups that they need. And they're going to end up right back there, probably even doing something worse this time. So I commend you on your effort. It's a wonderful effort. I know it's patterned after uh, an effort in Clay County, which has been very, very effective. So one thing that's important, you've, you've chosen a proven program, and uh, you've implemented uh, that, and uh, you'll be changing lives. So let me commend you on it and say thanks for the work. Governor, is there, we're having a take back your community march and rally, and, and this clip will be shown to the folks in Hopkins County. Is there a word of encouragement you'd like to tell the folks that are at this rally? Let me say thanks for participating, first of all. If you look at the drug efforts that have been successful, they can't come from the top down. They've got to come from the bottom up. They have to come from communities. And when you can get communities excited uh, about this sort of effort, then you can change your communities and, and you'll change lives. So let me commend you, thank you, and encourage you to continue your effort uh, toward really turning your community around, taking it back, and uh, fighting this war on drugs. Thank you.